we are back. So, I went by the store, and they had some Topps Archives blaster boxes. We haven't ripped any of those yet here on this channel, so I know a lot of people have. But, why not? I rip a little bit of everything. And they let me get three things. They only had two of these left. So, of course, what's the thing that's been treating us nice lately? We've been pulling bangers. Complete awesome super cards out of these so got some uh, update hanger box we're gonna rip the archives first and then we'll get into that so set those right there got two things that came in the mail today so we'll get this going here hope everybody out there is having a nice evening it is a monday I gotta go back to work tomorrow and then work all the way through Christmas. So, definitely not happy about that. But, oh, okay. Shout out to DC Sports 87. Same year I was born. So, cool, cool. This is gonna be my boy, Anthony Simons, who is in his third year or fourth year. 2018-19 season, so third year. Anthony Simons has been killing it. He's definitely taken that big step up um, and is really showing that talent. I mean, he won the dunk contest last year, but he is like our next protege behind Damian Lillard and CJ McCollum. So picked up a couple more of his Prism rookie cards. I think I've got about 15 of these base ones, but I've got a few silvers. I did not have a red. And this is the Red Cracked Ice Prism Rookie, which is the team color match, of course, here in Portland. Gotta love that. And then, ooh, this baby. That is a triple patch, game-used, autograph rookie card. And his jersey number is 24. And if you guys already know, I target those jersey numbered cards. And this is numbered 24 out of 149. They had one out of 50 that was a tier 2, which is the next rarity level, but this was jersey numbered, and uh, I said screw it, and I pulled the trigger on this one too. But some Anthony rookie cards there for the PC. I mean, basically, when I have cards for my PC like that, I'm just hoping that they pan out, and then I, you know, sell them, of course, and then reinvest in new stuff, so... It's kind of what I try to do is turn my collection over. Oh. Got a Zach Daniels. This is from Pro Debut. Numbered 150 out of 150. Blue autograph. He's all right, you know. I think his OPS was like 800 or something. or Yeah, 831. But when he was in Tennessee, his OPS was over 1,200, so... See what happens. Lots of young kids. You know, I'll pick up an auto here and there if I see a good deal on it. But what do you guys think we should do? The archives first or the hanger? We've already done hangers, so let's just rip into this and get it done. We've had amazing luck with these lately. Hopefully that continues. They had more of these, but I wanted to mix it up and do something different. I just don't want to keep buying hangers. Because I bought, like... I would say 20 out of the 28 that I bought were just trash. But those last eight boxes, I couldn't miss, man. I'm hitting numbered cards every time. Hit that Ian Anderson rookie auto, numbered out of 50. I mean, we've just been pulling heat, man. Numbered cards in every single box. So, Let's see if we can get that luck for the one time. Split it right above the middle stack here. Take the middle stack off the top. Put it there in the back. And we'll rip through these base first. Nice and quick like. Ryan Matten. Yeah, let's see. This are just... Let's flip these over. This is ridiculous. All right. Will Vest, rookie. Got... Arihara, which I've got a couple really good rookies I've pulled of his so far. Nick Nelson. I've never even heard of him, so Victor Gonzalez. 
Jorge Guzma. Speak of Ian Anderson, rookie debut there. Alec Baum, rookie debut. We also pulled a orange ice of his rookie debut and a Ian Anderson or a Jonathan India orange ice also. Say Dylan Carlson, Jazz Chisholm. We're getting all the good rookie debuts. Just need a Key Brian. I'd like to hit a Kellenic in here. Bailey Odor. There's a Ha Sung Kim rookie debut. A Luis Patino in the Rays jersey. Funkhauser. I got a bunch of Patino cards. Hopefully Joe Musgrove comes back and plays better this year. We got Kalomi. Clark Schmidt debut. I didn't really see how the second half of his season went. I know he was playing decent, but he had a lot of hype at one point. We'll see what happens. Put these rookies off to the side. Get into this middle stack. Wish me some luck. Tyler Wells. Evan White. Logan Allen. Can we get something banging? Come on. Give us a banger. Come on. Ben Roar to vert. Oh, we got a backwards card. Orange Ice Dylan Tate, though. Not a rookie. But man, I'm telling you, I can't miss. I'm shooting 100%. It's a Derek Jeter throwback card. I thought that was an auto, dude. I was about to lose it. Oh, I wish. Tyler Glass now. Hopefully... He comes back playing well. Otani throwback. Manny Machado. Pete Alonzo. Clayton Claus. Turnbull. We got a Chris Rodriguez rookie. And a Tyler Naquin. So, nothing crazy in that box. Did get another numbered rook or a non rookie numbered card there. We got a Jeter and a bunch of rookies. So, that's what you get with update. Uh, sleeve that bad boy up. And my sleeves are over here. Pardon me. Even though it's not a rookie, I've gotten tons and tons of numbered cards. So stick him and the inserts off to the side here. And we'll get into these archives boxes. So I'm not totally sure... What's up with these? It says three exclusive 89 tops big foil cards inside. I've got a, quite a few of those big cards. Um, I don't know if you get like a relic or an auto in every box. Maybe in the megas. I don't know. I haven't really seen much of these, honestly. I've never been a huge fan of archives, but I always give something a shot once, you know. See if we can get lucky and pull something cool. Two boxes, not the end of the world. They were 20 bucks each. Let's see if we can get it. I like how they went back to like the old style packs, it feels like. These feel like old wax packs almost, but like plastic. Alright. Can we get some luck? Bring me some luck, guys. Got Blake Snell. There's an Akil Badu. Rookie card. I like it. I'll take it. Joey Votto. Randy Johnson. The legend. Juan Gonzalez. The legend. Alec Bohm. Shining star. Bazooka. That's a cool one. George Springer. And Trey Mancini. Look at that. That's a fun set. And I wish we could open. Boy, oh boy. I would love that. I like that Bazooka card. That's a cool one. So that must be the uh, one of the sets variations there. I like Badu also. I think Detroit and uh, the Mariners and the or Orioles and the Blue Jays are going to be good this year, man. I think they're going to be way better than what people think. I would be surprised if one of those four teams does not win the World Series this year. We'll see what happens. But Eric Hosmer. Not who we're looking for. 
Braden. There's a Debbie Garcia rookie. Freddie Freeman. Marco Gonzalez. It is fun getting all the different sets, you know. There's a Dylan Carlson. A Trevor Story. That's those big foil cards. They're not big, though. They're the regular size of uh, stock cards. I have a bunch of these of the original set. And uh, there's a Kyle Schwarber. It's a guy I PC. Dave Winfield. But they're not hollow foil, I don't think. I'm pretty sure they were all just regular card stock back then. Chipper Jones. I'm so used to seeing young Chipper that when I see the older Chipper. Lincium. Robin Yount. Kent Harbeck. Oh my. The 1995 Seattle Mariners. Jay Bauer. Bonner. Edgar Martinez. Ken Griffey Jr. Randy Johnson. A sick card. Definitely like that one. That will definitely go uh, mixing up my piles here. Put these bad boys over there with Chipper and the Mariners card. What do we got here? Zach Grinky, Luis Robert, and Nolan Arenado. What are these? Tops 140. It's weird. We got uh, like every card has been different so far, and then we get one pack with those there. It's nice just opening something different that I haven't seen opened a lot. I don't really watch people open archives. There's an Andrew Vaughn. That's a good one. There's an Ian Anderson. Another good one. Pete Alonzo, the man. Ivan Rodriguez. That dude was a monster. Dustin May, hopefully coming back after Tommy Johns this year, going to play well. A Jazz Chisholm, another good one. Zach Gallen and Colton Wong. Three packs left. I wonder what how long the odds are to pull an autograph of some kind in here. You'll get a good idea about what you're looking at when you open two blasters, you know. You kind of get a good taste of it, but... Manny Machada. Got Brian Anderson. Mike Yastrzemski. Leody Tavares. We got Chris Bryant. Alex Bregman. Not who we're looking for here. That would be sick to pull a Kellenic in one of those. We got Kyle Hendricks, Reese Hoskins, and Pee Wee Reese. It's funny how that 2011 set has kind of just become so iconic, man, that it's going to be in every archive set for eternity now. We got Colin Moran. Mixing up my stacks again. Ooh, Key Brian. Justin Verlander. Bo Bichette. That's a cool one. Jacob DeGrom. Dylan Carlson. That's a sick card there. Carlos Delgado. And Carl Yastrzemski again. Alright, last plaque. Pack of the Blaster. Not plaque. Stan Musel, Shohei Otani, Randy Rosarena, Lucas Giolito, Trevor or Tanner Hook, The Family, Dave Parker, Willie Stargell, Manny Sangolin, we got Brooks Robinson, and a Rob Feller. And JT Ralmuto. So that's the first blaster. Nothing but base rookies in that one. These were the last two, so 
I mean, I didn't really have much of a choice to get my lucky grab, but maybe they left us the lucky box because they knew we were coming. I don't know. Let's see if any of these... It's hard to tell if any feel thick or not. Sometimes I think I feel one that feels thicker, but with these packs with all the different size cards. Man, these are not easy to open either. Definitely like the Gypsy Queen packs. You gotta really pull that corner to get in there. Tyler Glasnow, Albert Pujols, Jorge Soler, there's my boy. Mookie Betts, Adam Frazier. We got a Edward Olivares, a Mickey Moniak, and a Ryan Weathers. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys haven't subscribed, hit that button for me, man. Come on now. Only takes you a second. It's free for you. Helps out the channel a lot. Leave a comment if you want. Andrew McCutcheon. Let me know what you guys want me to open next, you know. We got you, Darvish. Ken Griffey Jr. I'll take it. A PC Griffey all day. I probably got a thousand Griffey cards over there. Tim Anderson, Clark Schmidt rookie. That's got Raleigh Fingers, Reggie Jackson, Vita Bloom, Blue Moon Odom, Catfish Hunter, and Genie Tennis. Got Cody Bellinger and Juan Soto. Very cool. Down to these next ones. I picked up a pretty cool Vladdy card. That's why I got Vladdy in the background. I was thinking about it. I thought it was going to come in the mail today, but it'll be in my next video probably. So keep an eye out for that next video. I got a banger coming. Eddie Rosario. Kyle Seeger, who's a free agent. Hopefully, it doesn't sound like the Mariners are going to sign him again, but that would be nice. I like Kyle Seeger a lot. Him and Mitch Hanniger this year went over 30 home runs each. Steven Strasburg, Ozzy Smith, Bryce Harper. We got a Dave Winfield, an Alan Trammell, Jesus Lazardo, and Jose Barrero, rookie. Not a lot of rookies out of this one so far. I would have rather have zero rookies and hit an auto. There's a Cal Ripken Jr., Nick Castellanos, Jack Flaherty, Lorenz Kane, Paul Monitor, a Dylan Carlson Bazooka, Luis Garcia, rookie, and a Michael Brantley. Three packs left, guys. Come on. Let's get some luck here. Estevan Florial rookie, Ernie Banks, Mike Schmidt, Jeff Bagwell, Uncle Larry, Andrew McCutcheon, looking like a swaggy boy there. Ryan Jeffers, Mike Moustakis, and Alec Bohm. I haven't seen any numbered cards yet. That's also an interesting thing. I don't know if you get numbered parallels in this set or not, but I should have watched some of these get open first. I hate just getting tons and tons of base cards, man. If you spend 40 50 bucks, you want to get something of value. Kirilov, these base rookies ain't doing it. They're like a dollar a piece. <laughs> Look at Guriel Jr. with that blue freaking hair sticking out. Greg Maddox, Lou Gehrig. Elvis Andrus. Still haven't hit any rookies in that foil big cards. Dalton Varsho. Wilson Contreras. Last pack. When I was flipping through, I thought this felt thicker, but we'll see. Nope. <laughs> nope. No thicky. Mark McGuire. See, you think, you know, you're like, oh, man, there's so many legends in this product. What if I hit, like, a cool auto or something? But Chris Bryant, 
Brent Rooker. We're not even getting good rookies, man. Willie Adonis. Nolan Ryan. JT Brubaker. Mike Piazza. Derek Jeter. Barry Larkin. Well, that was a bummer. I mean, I flipped through all the fronts for sure. There was nothing numbered, but at least for the rookies and big cards here, I'll flip through and look at the backs, but... I mean, you'd think a card would be flipped over or something if it was numbered, but who knows? I haven't really watched this product get opened. See, that's how my hanger boxes started off, too, you know? But then we hit some big, big cards, so it is what it is, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Definitely happy with... Uh, the Anthony Simons cards there that I picked up. Some cool ones. The Red Ice and some Rookies. Very, very cool. But, like I said, foreshadowing up here for what is to come. If you guys didn't see that video where I picked these two bad boys up. Purple Hot Box, hot box Refractor and a Pink Tops Chrome Rookie. And this is for sale right now, too, so... If you guys know anybody who's a big Boba Chet collector, this is a Pop 2 gold autographed PSA 10 numbered out of 50. You can see it's numbered right there. Pop 2 on card auto. Only two PSA 10s in existence. And if somebody does buy that, I'll throw that bad boy in, which is a gold Boba Chet numbered out of 50. One year apart there. Whoop. There goes the neighborhood. Thank you guys for watching. Sometimes you get some bangers. It looks like, man, our luck is better with these hanger boxes, in my opinion. Um, I've pulled the heat out of those. So stay up out there. Be safe this holidays in case I don't see you before Christmas. Much love. Peace.